Well, hello there, and thanks for coming by and having tea with Linda. In case you didn't know, I'm Linda. Hi! Today is day number 11 on our Bird and Blend Tea Advent Calendar, and I'm very excited to see what they have in store for us today. So let's pull out our day 11 box and see what we have. All right, so today's is Panatone. Of course, I'm sure I've said that wrong. It's P-A-N-E-T-T-O-N-E, -T -T -E, Panatone. Um, that's usually those like breads that have the um, the little num nums in them, um, kind of like a fruit cake. Only it's not a cake; it's more like a yeasted bread, I believe. Um, it says notes of spiced fruit in this festive green blend. Uh, this one is 80 C. Oops. Uh, and it is without milk, and we brew for three minutes, which is the first time we have a three-minute brew time. So let's pull that out. Uh, our ingredients are Chinese sencha green tea, Chinese chunni green tea. Um, I thought that said schizophrenia berries, but schizandra, schizandra berries, apple pieces, rose hips, hibiscus, orange peel, and natural flavoring. Um, so I don't quite know what to make of that. I don't know what those berries are, but that doesn't mean anything. There's a lot of things I don't know about. And sometimes I just run my mouth and act like I know it anyway. Uh, all right, so you can tell that this is a Sencha tea uh, that is in the bag um, with how those leaves look. It doesn't really have a smell to it. Uh, Sencha teas that I've had in the past have kind of smelled, or not smelled, but they've had a, uh, a very like vegetable taste to them. So I'm kind of interested in this one um, to see what kind of taste we get out of it. Oh, all right. Hey Siri, set a timer for three minutes. All right, three minutes is our middle one. That is our green one. If this is your first time to the channel, thanks for coming by. I appreciate it tremendously. If this is you coming back to see what kind of fun we can have with our Bird and Blend Tea Advent Calendar, I appreciate that you've come back to see me. Hi, how you doing? I hope everything's been good for you. Um, I This is day number 11 for our Bird and Blend calendar. And I must say, I'm very much looking forward to it. Uh, we've had uh, 10 really interesting teas from the Bird and Blend calendar. Uh, there's been a couple that have been a swing and a miss for me. Um, and there have been some that have been a swing and a home run. So uh, I'm, I'm very interested to see what kind of flavors we get from uh, the Sencha Green Tea with the Num Nums that it has added to it. Um, so that will be extremely fun. <laughs> hey Siri, stop timer. All right, our three minute timer has elapsed. And let's take a look at this green tea. Uh, the leaves have plumped up tremendously um, and have filled the bag quite nicely. Um, I'll pull this over since, so you can kind of see. Um, the tea is absolutely clear. There's no particulate in it. It's totally see-through. Oh, I take that, I take that back. There is a little bit of particulate, but it's not much. 
uh, it has a very it has a very interesting smell to it it doesn't smell like sencha leaves it smells kind of like cocoa and I have forgotten what it has in it at this point let me take a look again berries apple pieces rosehip hibiscus orange peel hmm interesting okay actually I can get behind this tea um, you can taste the sencha but it's not an overwhelming taste uh, it's not overly vegetable um, it's it has just a nice green tea undercurrent to it uh, and um, on the back end it's it, it's just a very mellow flavor that is very well blended and it it honestly does taste a little cake like without it being like a cake um, <laughs> I call it a marvel if you will but it it really is it really does taste like what it is the, the pentatone. I am enjoying that. I'm enjoying that quite a bit. Um, there does look like there is some particulate in it, but it's not an awful lot. Uh, I This is sweet without being like sugar sweet. Um, it's light and delicate. Um, but it's 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 very yummy uh, this could easily be a dessert tea without any issue I am really enjoying that Wow this this is my cup of tea I'm really enjoying this completely uh, I would be happy to serve this to other people to share with it it is blended very nicely it is a very smooth tea and it's it's for a green tea it doesn't have an excessive amount of caffeine in it um, but it is still caffeinated but that is quite yummy i'm i'm really enjoying that i'm really enjoying that um all right then well thanks for coming by and having a couple with me today i really do appreciate it i hope you have an amazing rest of your day and i'm looking forward to seeing you tomorrow <laughs> bye Well, hey there, did you enjoy the content today? I really hope so. If you did, think about subscribing. That would really help me out. Thanks.